Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Explorer Patcher, which is a third-party UI customization app, as many of you may well know, to modify the Windows user interface, has been in the news of late, um, in particular in regards to blocking upgrades to Windows 11 24H2 if Explorer Patcher is installed. And I have posted on that, and I'll leave a video in the end screen because we had a look at a workaround um, to prevent that from happening. Now, we don't normally talk about third-party um, apps on this channel, but because the, the Explorer Patcher saga is so um, so closely linked to Windows 11 24H2, which is this year's annual feature update, I thought I'd just post this quick video just to give you a heads up because I do know that some of you do use the Explorer Patcher app. Now, just to let you know that they have just released a new version of the app. So if we head over to GitHub, here we can see Explorer Patcher, the latest version, 22621.3527.65.1. And here's an important change they have made in this latest version of Explorer Patcher for Taskbar 10, where they say the Windows 10 Taskbar option is no, now no longer available on 26,002 and later. So those are the builds, the 26,000 builds of Windows 11 that are currently being tested in the Insider program. And those builds are in the Canary and Dev channel where Microsoft uh, is testing features that could possibly roll out with 24H2. So that's why they've mentioned those builds. And the reason for this is this is to comply, they say, with Microsoft's removal of the stock Windows 10 taskbar in explorer.exe of said builds and I have posted on that as well and I may leave that video in the end screen as well if you would like a little bit more info so basically at the end of the day with this new version of Explorer Patcher you will no longer be able to revert to the Windows 10 taskbar on a computer running Windows 11 version 24H2 so that's the long and the short of it and just wanted to put it out there because I know some of you as mentioned do use the app now, this is also over and above posting that um, there was a full list of apps that was spotted that could block upgrades to Windows 11 24H2. And Explorer Patcher and Start All Back were on that list. And I will leave that video as well in the end screen because obviously there's a lot going on here where Microsoft is now opposing a lot of these um, customization apps and um, other apps um, that could prevent... Um, you upgrade into Windows 11 24H2 and this is due to the fact that obviously Microsoft is saying that these customization apps and some other apps are causing problems especially in the early preview builds and that's why they are blocking them um, or causing them not to open because they are interfering with the development and the upgrade process to Windows 11 24H2 but nonetheless as mentioned Explorer Patcher now removes um, the ability now um, for you to um, enable the old Windows 10 taskbar in Windows 11 24H2. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.